And I want to call this out mainly because I myself am a much newer player to WWE 2K. So for me, picking up and playing has been the whole experience. The controls are super easy to learn. And while my own habits fall back on button mashing the controller, even though we have that, I enjoy having to be very strategic and intentional about how I'm approaching this game, especially when it comes to the timing of things like reversals or finishers. So I can definitely attest to, hey, if you're feeling intimidated by this, please don't. Pick it up, try it out. You'll have such a blast. But also, if you're a vet, and you've been playing this for a long, long time, uh, can y'all talk about how vets can better show off their moves and what that means for the overall strategy of their experience? So a lot of the strategy for our game comes with the new defensive options that we've added this year. So one of the biggest examples is breakers. Uh, instead of reversals being the only tool for countering your opponent's attacks, uh, grapples and combos actually don't use reversals. Instead, you counter them with a breaker. So when you're doing a grapple or a combo on your opponent, they can counter that attack by pressing the same light, heavy, or grapple input against you. So those moves are countered with breakers. Everything else is countered with a reversal. So knowing what kind of attack you expect your opponent to perform can already prime you to know how you want to counter it. So there's already a mind game with that level. Then you have blocking, which is all new. Uh, if you hold down the reversal button, you enter a blocking stance, and that lets you withstand light, heavy, and running attacks. Uh, and then you can counterattack faster than your opponent can after blocking. Uh, you can also dodge with the right bumper. So you can kind of choose a direction and get out of the way really quickly if you time your dodge correctly. But it's higher risk than a block. And then when you're on the ground, you also can button mash to get up faster, or you can press right bumper to do a quick get up uh, at the cost of some resource. So when you have all of those defensive options available to you, it makes when you're on defense, that's a lot more strategic, but also when you're on offense, you have to be careful with how you want to attack your opponent so that they don't counter you. So our community has been speculating about the HUD and like guessing like what, you know, these little glowing meters.